You're watching CBS 42, local coverage you can count on. This is the CBS 42 News at Noon. So right now we are just one week away from the return of UAV football. Yes, and joining me now we have the <laughs> voice of the Blazers, David Crane. Now the Blazers are opening up their season against Savannah State. That's happening next week. So yep. what can fans expect for that first game? We hope weather just like today. I know. Uh, 85 yes. degrees and no humidity would be Fantastic. Can't promise that, but uh, it, it's going to be great. They've really worked on uh, the the atmosphere mm -hmm. surrounding the games, making it more fan and family friendly. So Blazer Village, uh, sponsored by Chick-fil-A this year, yes. opens four hours before kickoff. Uh, you can tailgate. You can, you can sort of do your one-stop shopping to get your own tailgate set up where all you do is show up, eat, drink, and go watch football. Um, and if you're tailgating, you can get involved in the Buffalo Wild Wings tailgate competition, which runs before every home game. So uh, there's plenty of stuff to do. The, the Blazer Walk, the team shows up and walks through everybody on their way to the stadium. So uh, if the weatherman cooperates, uh, Nate. if he cooperates, uh -huh. it, it should be a great day next Thursday. Okay, so you've told us a little bit about what we can anticipate outside of the game. Yep. What about when we get in that stadium? What do you feel like the atmosphere is going to be like this year, the team? I think it's uh, hopefully picking up exactly where they left off mm -hmm. in the regular season last year. We're going to skip over the bowl, <laughs> the bowl no, game sure, and just sure. let's hope we pick off. They were perfect at home last season. Um, the first game last year had a record crowd, over 40,000. Mm -hmm. It would be wonderful to have a similar turnout for the game Thursday night. Uh, again, starting a little earlier, not being on the first Saturday, I think is great. Mm -hmm. UAB fans have always been really supportive when you've played on, on midweek, uh, non-Saturday games. So I think starting on that first Thursday, a week from today, hopefully that'll get a lot of the folks out and, and everybody's so anxious, so ready for football. The fact that you can do it on Thursday makes it a little better. Anxious for football is a little bit of an understatement. <laughs> Thank you so, so much for being here. Thank we you. so much appreciate it. If you're looking to grab tickets, we've got all the info for you on the CBS 42 News app. Keep it right here. We'll be right back. Thanks.